I'm Oyun Dindamnaru, UNICEF representative in the Philippines. In the 75 years of UNICEF's presence in the Philippines, we have grown stronger together in advocating for the rights of the Filipino women and girls. On International Women's Day, we joined the international community in celebrating our collective commitment to stand with women and girls in their urgent call for equality, protection, and true participation in all aspects of their lives. For years, women and girls in the Philippines and around the globe have been calling for urgent global climate action, and we need to listen now. They are most vulnerable to climate-induced disaster. The impact of Typhoon that has left Almost a half million girls in need of urgent assistance. Overnight, they lost their homes, their school modules, and learning equipment. They were left without access to safe water and electricity, and extremely vulnerable to exploitation and abuse, including sexual violence. The world must recognize that the climate crisis is a child rights crisis. If we do not act now, girls and women will continue to pay the highest price. The fate of the whole generation of women is at stake. Over the years, UNICEF has been working with the governments, businesses, leaders around the world to address climate change. In the Philippines, UNICEF advocates increasing financing and research in the country to understand how we can lessen the risks of climate change for children. Establishing resilient public services for children such as water, health and education in times of climate emergency. And most importantly, empowering children to be agents of change by providing them with platforms to lead and take action. Climate action means protecting women and girls in every corner of the world. And UNICEF remains steadfast in our commitment to win this battle for every child.